Hello there, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to Rocks and Gear Posse. It's actually a pleasure to have you. Thank you very much for joining us. Today we are going to be celebrating Starlight Celebrations in Final Fantasy XIV. Now, obviously, I have not been um, really active in Final Fantasy XIV for a long time. MMOs just take a lot of time to really get into and really actually enjoy. In fact, I am still playing Heavensward. I have not actually played any of the Stormblood content. I, have, I actually have bought myself Stormblood as a Christmas gift to myself. And as you can see, we are still dressed <laughs> in our festive gear from last year. Obviously looking as seasonal as possible for Britain Longbow. So if anybody actually wants to join us while we're playing through this today, we're on the Lich server on the EU. Uh, obviously you need to be a level 15 uh, player to be able to take play as part in this event. And I know Lich isn't the most common European server. It was back whenever I started playing the game, but it isn't now. But uh, if anybody happens to be there, more than welcome. And I hope to actually see these all in gameplay. But we're going to jump in and maybe jump into the Starlight Celebrations. So the Starlight Celebrations theming for this year is if you go out into the woods today, you're going to get a big surprise. If you go down in the woods today, you better not go in disguise because today the bears, the seasonal bears, will be at play. <laughs> um, essentially, a teddy bear's picnic versioning set into Starlight Celebration somehow wintry and festive and uh, I like the idea, I like the premise. It's taking place in Old Gredenia, or at least the starting off mission is actually in Old Gredenia. And I imagine we have to go hunting for bears, which is like, kind of an impressive choice for actually like, I don't know how that relates to the presents and gifts and goodwill, but we're probably going to make friends with the bears and that's why we get to ride one as a gift at the end of this whole thing. But yep, yeah, we're festively dressed up for our seasonal events and obviously Old Gredenia is looking absolutely glorious. Oh, look at you. Beautiful, beautiful, festive city. Just gonna make sure to get the chat live here as well, so in case I happen to see any of you guys talking. There we go! All is good and grand. Well, let's just take a wee look around. Um, nobody's actually here yet, as far as I know. Um, a couple of people that we actually hung out with last year during the Starlight Celebration after I completed the whole thing. Uh, keep firing on those snowballs, kid. It looks so, in it's so enticing, so inviting. So let's jump in and actually take part of the event. I'm going to get this out of the way first. Stars and explosions and bears. Oh my. I'm Gra Garana, how's it? Garanji needs your help to make a success of this year's Starlight Celebration. The quest is available for a limited time only. Yes, indeed it is. What? 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 Oh god damn it. I go into my duty log and actually remove some stuff. <laughs> uh, journal, that's what I'm moving on. And I get rid of you. Abandon. And abandon. <laughs> A wee reminder to myself to actually be taking part in this today. <laughs> I knew I knew I was going to be doing it today, and my alarm system just reminded me that yes, you should be. You really, really should be. So, uh, bum, 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 mum's a word. What's this? It's a level fifty of it. Uh, I'll come back to you. Yeah, yeah, I can do it. See, they're so happy. He's clapping his hands. Right. Uh, long last, we meet again. Surely it's Nymelia's prevalence that has guided you to me in this capacity as a starlight celebrant. That I must ask for your assistance. The Starlight Celebration is the most wonderful time of the year, especially for the little ones. We strive to make each year's festivities more spectacular than the last. Yet there are those who would undermine our carefully laid plans. The spate of thefts has left many without decorations. Several of my associates have been asked, tasked with the investigation, and as a result, we are understaffed. Will you help us? Of course I will. I'll bring the festive cheer to the children. You will? I know we can rely on you. Please speak with my trusted comrade. Ben failed in the bread, bread meadows. We'll be grateful for any kind of aid you can provide. Um, ba -ba -dum. Can I take your bear with me? I want your bear to come with me. I love this bear. Right, moving on. Right, where are we looking for? Uh, boom. boom. This is our active quest. This is where I need to be. Ben Branch Meadows, come on. Oh, I feel so weird because my control, my, my knowledge of the control has gone to shoot. So, center bed, front meadows. Uh, 
I can't remember where it is the most convenient place for Ben Branch, ben, ben Branch Meadows. Oh, it's one of those things where games like this, whenever you just don't spend as much time in the world anymore, it's so unbelievably lost. There we go, Central Shroud. I knew it was there. Yes, you actually do remember the murder game, do you, uh, JP? Uh, that was Danganronpa, which we'd love to come back and do. Um, Danganronpa 1, 2 Reload is available, and then there's a third one that came out recently. After playing the demo, that was really good fun, but um, I don't know. It's a... Would people be interested in what... Said you watching what is a visual novel and me just doing the voices for it? Because most of the voices are actually done in the game now. There he is there. Way! Look your family of bears. Oh, look at the big bear. The meme's out there. And the baby bear. And I want to ride the baby bear. I need to use it. I want to use it as a mount. Yes, I know you just want to help with the festival, but what can I do? Me hands are tied. Well, I'll be. You're the one who helped with the Starlight Bell a while back. To what do I owe the pleasure? Oh, it was Anne Granley, Granley that I, who asked you to come here. Was it? I had a feeling that she'd send someone, and I'm full glad she did. So she told you about all the decorations getting pinched. Terrible business. I tell you, one morning that we woke up to find them all stolen, and the young ones round here had only just finished putting them up. Her little tykes. It was heartbroken. They're still down in the dumps about it now. Can't blame them, really. Especially after all the effort they put in. We've got people looking into the thefts, myself included, but no one but no one to take care of the Starlight Celebration itself here in Bent Branch. I got this shit. Ah, <sighs> you'll be getting your chance. You think you spent all that time practicing for nothing? Them young'uns will be grinning ear to ear when they see what you got in store. Huh? What's that? You don't know what they're saying? I well, suppose not everyone understands bears like I do. He's a big bear lover. We're glad someone nice is here to help us. Don't you worry, we'll have them little ones smiling again in no time, is what we was saying. Can't you see? It's written all over his adorable face of his. Look at that fuzzy chops. Mm -hmm. I got this. Ha! Yeah, it's me explaining bear speak. And I haven't even told you what we'll be doing. These three have been trained to love, to love these starbursts, sparkly and colorful they are, like little fireworks. They'll do the chucking, and all you've got to do is ride them to the right place and maybe show them where to chuck. <laughs> ah! <laughs> That's the spirit. You'd think an explosion like that would sting a bit, but the boom's worse than a bite. Anyway, pick from Polaris. Kochab ah, are perfect. They're all good lads. Just go for the one of the go for the one easiest to ride. Uh If I'm gonna ride any of them, I am fucking riding Polaris. Oh, this bear is too big. This bear is just right. <laughs> Aww. Hey, buddy. He said, all right, Miss, Miss Venture. Let's go and cheer up them children. You can see the determination in his eyes, that steely resolve. <laughs> You're exactly right, man. It is like a, pretty much a, like a Three Bears storyline. What was it? Goldilocks, wasn't it? Yeah. Let's see, I'm purple haired. Well, I'm actually, oh shit, in real life, I actually am closer to Goldilocks. Yeah, <laughs> I can tell you two are going to get on just fine. Well, I've got some investigating to do. Suppose you two, uh, you other two, might as well give me a hand and look, give me a hand looking for the thieves. If you are as good at sniffing out criminals as you are at sniffing out grub in the party, country, we'll have them in no time. <laughs> I'll leave the Starburst to you and your new best friend. Now get out there and spread some cheer. So they're just ride a bear to a location. Do the Starburst. 
Right, the Baron Lord occasion. Do the Star Force. This works for me. Throwing a Starburst here should give a favorable reaction. Teats. Oh, excuse my language. I mean, gods be good. Did that bear just throw a bomb? <laughs> Amazing! That was great. Why did you shoot it to Taff? He's down by the Chocobo stables. Alright. To the lad with the Chocobo stables. Oh, Chocobo stables are this way. Nope, that's the porter. The Chocobo stables are actually up here. I don't know why I was actually going to the chocolate board. Hey, Taff, how's it going, boyo? These are the chocolate board stables. Why? Okay. Where am I meant to be going? Ah, uh, this will make it a little bit easier. Roar, jump. Roar. Damn it, it was actually here that I was meant to go. Ah, shouldn't doubt myself. Huh, you scared me for a moment. The bear threw that? I guess that's funny in a way. Huh. You. You're trying to cheer me up? Oh, that's very kind of you. Sorry, I guess I'm not having a very good day. No matter what I say, no one will listen. But you will, won't you? I'll tell you if you promise not to call me a fibber. Yeah. Uh, bear dude! Bear dude! You promise? Alright, I suppose I can trust you. You heard about the decorations going missing, didn't you? I know who took them. I saw him do it. But when I told the others, they didn't believe me. They called me a fibber. It's not fair. But you're not like them. You believe me, right? If I tell you who did it, will you catch them and bring back all the decorations? Got you, sorry, kiddo. You tell me where to go, I'll get this done. Means I can kick some butts. Kick it all the butts. You mean you'll get the decorations back? Thank you so much, miss. Aye. What's this about? Coachop came looking for me and told me to leg it back here. Everything all right? Well, you see, this kid knows where they are. And your investigation's a pile of bullshit. What? This little nipper saw the thief? Yep, that's exactly what I just told you. I did. The starlight tree nicked all of the decorations and stuck them all over itself. Uh... Well, the other one. It's got bells on. He was robbed by a tree? By far... But far fetched, don't you think? What do you make of all this? I believe it. Trees are evil. Yeah, that's bollocks. <laughs> yeah, that's bollocks. Nah, that'd be terrible. I think, ah, oh, I'm so regretting not saying it was bollocks. <laughs> you believe me? I knew you weren't like all the others. I really was the starlight tree. I saw. I swear. All right, son, let's slow down, eh? You sure you don't mind to see it? Is it too much cheese before bed, perhaps? No, oh, ho, oh, oh. ho. This vigilant young man speaks the truth. Hey! It's you. You show up to help us every start of celebration. You're go a wandering pilgrim, come to see Jay, to see justice is served. I can vouch for the boy's testimony, as I too witnessed this heinous crime with my very eyes. But what say you, adventurer? What do your instincts tell you? The prime suspect is none other than a treant. Verily, you have cut straight to the heart of the matter, for the true criminal is not more than a common treant, dripped in plundered Starlight Celebration finery. Treant? 
Come to mention it, I've one of those made off of a load of starlight grubbins that might look a bit like a starlight tree. This is not all for a... Not for I saw not... That's not all for I saw not one but a whole corpse of these culprits. All similarly bespangled, shambling the way south. I don't mind to smite the wretched lot of them there and then, but I realize that if my hammer of legend were to strike down the fiends, the decoration would see we seek to reclaim would suffer the same fate. Another approach is needed, I methinks. Aye, well, we go to find a way to nab those bark faced bastards without breaking anything. But how are we going to do that? I'm not swearing for a Christmas story. <laughs> We lob a bunch of starbursts at the tree and we can stun them without damaging our stuff. Worth a try, I reckon. First we track them down. If they're heading south, the starlight celebrant by Gallop and Spire probably saw them. I'll go ahead with the bears and have a word with the lads st stationed down there. We'll wait for you before making our move. A fine plan indeed. All that remains is to round up the troublemakers and make those darling children smile once more. Now go, adventurer. May the raging flames of your righteous soul spare not those who defy he who defy the will of Demelia. Well, and we're off to adventure. Mount Roulette! God damn it, every time. I wish I never got this YouTube one. Alright, try it again. Mount Roulette! That's. Oh, wow. Damn. Okay, so we are going south. And south, south, south. South, 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 south. Whoop. Ah, oh, wasn't too far to go. Just as we suspected, a whole troop of them have been shuffling by the by the mar mirror planks. The bears are in position and ready when you are. When our quarry shows up, have a word with have a word with the starlight bear handler to grind Kochab and start flinging them starbursts. All right. Once you got them stunned, we'll take care of the rest. There might even be a few more adventurers willing to join you to do whatever it takes. Sweet. We got other people with us. Where am I going? Damn! I forgot to have my behemoth. Let's rock and roll. Bayfield's told me. Bayfield's told me about the plan. I've got Coach App right here, ready to throw some starbucks. Good luck out there. Oh shit. Yeah, very busy in here. Um Yeah. Hi festive people. <laughs> so it actually is one of those like public events that actually just waiting for it to respawn over and over again. Ah, that's gonna get interesting. some Christmas cheer! Spreading Christmas cheer! Spreading Christmas cheer! Covering people on Christmas cheer! Well, there we go. Uh, literally going to be waiting for a while now and another one joins us. <laughs> this is going to get interesting. Um, Literally just stand there looking at it as we just all fire at it at the exact same time. <laughs> this is like that Nova. It's probably going to spawn right in the middle of this. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. Uh, let's do the long wait now. I'm just waiting to see if actually people start running in circles around each other. That could could be like a paper boy. Throw the papers away. Let's see them they got the yeah, Yep, yep, yep. Could very well done. But it made more sense for a tree end to do it. I mean, to be honest, if, if people can accessorize themselves, why can't a tree end?
So, um, as much this is actually adorable. I do love the the line of bears and everybody who's dressed up and chilling out. Is that somebody dressed up as Squall? It looks like that. Cool. Um, everybody else dressed up as either green, festive spirits. Um, was me. Who else is in a starlight clothing? Oh uh, well. Runny, runny, runny times. Runny times. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't feel like it's actually going to be that long of a wait, but obviously uh, we've got time to chill. Hey, you all in trouble? Have some Christmas cheer. Hey, I told you. Christmas cheer. No, you stop it. People chilling, enjoying themselves. So, uh, yeah. We got a lot of time to waste here. Why? Who is firing at me? Oh, uh, well. Dun, dun, the man. Away. I love the fact that we're actually playing the chocolate music for this. Ah, uh, yeah, somebody picked a fight. Firing? Hey, as many of them as possible. <laughs> So where do we go now? Do we still hang around here? Or did we get enough of them? Look from the trees. Was that not me completing it there now? Oh, you. Okay. So I actually wasn't taking part in that at all. That's mildly annoying. I also for I just completely forgot about the level difference. God damn. That is super frustrating. Oh, hi there. He's doing some harvesting. Enjoy. God damn it. 
That was a stupid, stupid mistake on my part. Oh. Damn. Double damn. <laughs> well, I'll probably still be here whenever other people show up. Me too. Come save me from my own idiocy. All the festive tidings in this bear running section. Jump and fly and run around. Ooh, love jumpy jumpy jumpies, jumpy jumpies. What cool looking characters actually in here. Uh, I've seen all the changes in design people have had over the years. Hey, we wind up red mage. It'd be nice if we actually had like at least an idle animation for the bear. It'd be just like lying down, sitting there scratching his belly, chilling out in some way, shape, or form. Wait, hit discovered nearby? Bear? This is the one that we were doing. Yep, this is the one I'm meant to be doing. Come on. Bouncy, bouncy, bouncy. Love the way the dog, the, the bears like splay out at the back. Blur up. I'm looking forward to having this as a mount that I can summon. <laughs> this is gonna be weird actually having it in the mount roulette where everyone's well just gets immediately festive. Oh. That'd be nice if actually the bear did have the um, best of Christmas tropical music. That is cool. Come on. Come on. Come on. Derp. I didn't level sync last time. So, say hi to stream if you like. school whenever a teacher used to say like oh you go down that classroom and ask for a long wait I need one and then obviously um, the teacher gives you a long wait okay this is getting mildly frustrating I haven't been hooked onto a fate event. I can understand it means there's public involvement, but timings, oof, 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 I say. I imagine there's probably a lot more stuff or other stuff that's actually related after this. This was like the first step and this is what gets you the bear. Then everything after that is actually the, um, you can only do this five times per day or five, five times per event per day so that you actually can build up enough stuff to be able to buy the rare logs and rare furniture and uh, probably other weird stuff that's actually available for Christmas. But um, yeah, I've actually enjoyed these multi-step like multi 
Starlight of Celebration events that they've done previously. Uh, this obviously being uh, the first time I've ever the first time I've ever done a mount previously was always costumes. In fact, that's one thing I'm going to do. I'm going to change into my other best of costume. There we go. The sassier, sexier one. Bit more uh, Mrs. Claus, definitely. Which looks weird whenever she's riding on this bear. I thought you would have made sure the uh, Christmas clothing interacts well with the actual mount. Hey! That's more like it. more like it. You get back here. That was already got. Ah! Nice! <laughs> Unintentional hit. Goddamn delay between the actual hit and throw. We have to wait for the cluster. Like that! Hey! This we got this. On um, feel your trees. Perfect. Haha. <laughs> now we need to speak with Taff. Uh, back up this way. Right in our bears. Woo! We're barely concerning ourselves. Hey, Mitsu, thanks for joining. Uh, yeah, feel free to join in. I'm just going to complete this one, uh, run in and drop off the gear. What's this? Oh, God. Uh, good luck with the Dynamites. Barely making it on time. Bear faced audacity. Bear pun. Oh, you're back. How did it go? Yeah. All right. Ah, there you are. Great work, Britain. To you too, Cochab. Judging by the amount of decoration we got back, I'd say most of the treats have been dealt with. Treants have been dealt with. We couldn't have done it without you. So, Taff, you got anything you want to say? Merry Christmas, everyone. Thank you so much. I knew you'd come through for us. I'll make sure everyone knows what you did. Naimelia, bless you, miss. G goodbye. I want to be just like you. You know, miss, you're just like one of the saints' little helpers. Yeah, I've taken that title a few times. Is it my nose? Did my nose made me look like one of them? You cannot be certain, but somehow these you sense he is saying it was a pleasure to fight alongside you. We are thrilled that the joy of the Starlight Celebration has returned to Brand Branch Meadows. <coughs> also, furthermore, do you believe the political situation within Gridania is actually untenable? I have a lot of feelings about this, but I do not find the ability to express it in words. 
Yeah, my thanks as well, of course. Now we've got to put all the decorations back up, but I'm sure the young ones won't mind helping out. The Starlight Celebration's been saved, and it's all because of you. There are still a few odds and ends missing, probably tangled in some other tree ends. If you got time, you can help us look for them. The local youngsters in that terrific trio here would be quite pleased if you did. Aww. Bum, 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 bum. Woo! The night before, the nightmare before Starlight. Uh, so many people picking up their stuffs. So yep, yeah, I'm gonna use. Uh, bah, 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 bah. Where is my pocket? <laughs> yeah, it'd be in my character, wouldn't it? No, nope, it'll be in my. Where the hell is it gonna be my gear? God, I kind of, I'm so, so bad to remember where everything is in this inventory. <sighs> so stupid. So, boom, 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 boom. Throw that bear horn! Yes! So where do you get the starlight boxes? I got two from that. So where do I get more? Do I get ones from every single time I do that event? Oh, right, right. So, um, yeah, I put myself back in this gear, and I go to Mount Guide, and I have Berry Bear! <laughs> Woo! I'm very delighted to do this! So, I'm wondering if I actually go down here again, will there be another one? Is there literally, is, is that... That is all that there is for... Whoa, jeez. I straight completely lost track of where I'm going to be going there. Um, I need to go down this way. Right? That was the way to go, right? God damn it. If I look, I'm going to lost track of where I'm going. God damn. There's a lot of marbles down there. You okay? Oh, I know if I go the right way. <laughs> Thank you very much. <laughs> it's good to see you guys again. Okay, so the fate was just marked for the last time, so every single time I can go back to it. You enjoy you enjoyed watching? Thank you very much, JP, for watching. Watch me get lost, that's about it. So yeah, I'm gonna do this at least one more time. Oh, be on the one for the NPC. Yes, that makes sense. <laughs> Yes, my coach have. There we go. Now I can actually throw the prizes. So yeah, the um people just doing missions over the background. But yeah, so since you're doing this gets us starlight prizes presents, and now that we have the starlight presents, then that's what you do for the trade ins. Uh do you happen to know what the trade in writs are, Morgana, by any chance? <laughs> that's one of the things we're like I can see that, and then 45 seconds later, it shows up in the chat, or it shows up in the live stream, and somebody then can type it in. So we've got a minute and a half delay between messages. Feels like I'm back on BBS boards from back in the day. Boom, <laughs> Trying to capitalize by actually. Oh, no, wrong place. By hitting more than one at a time. Missed. Oh. 
Oh, those tree ants are so wrecked. Ah, down. Under the ship. Falls with Ollie. Hey! So two presents for each time we actually do that event. Not too bad. Yay! 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 So, um, I'm assuming we're actually back to Old Gridania for trade back in. For uh, trading in the presents, as far as I imagine. Is there a worthwhile of having a stock of these before we go over to actually pick up some bits and pieces. So I'm curious to know what the prices are for anything. Oh, Eerie. Hi there. <laughs> From the Norn Iron. Norn Iron. Um, yes. Hi, what's up? Same also from Northern Ireland. <laughs> Good to see you guys. It was actually so much fun running into these last year. Um, I had to come back and do it again as always. But um, yeah, I'm just curious now to figure out what we do next. Why hello there. So do we hang about here for a wee while longer? Or uh, do we actually go and cash in the prizes? Because that's essentially what I'm curious to know. <laughs> Aw, thank you very much. I would actually type in response, but I do not have a keyboard hooked up to the PlayStation 4 at the moment. I would need to get a multi, like a USB hub, or at least a Bluetooth keyboard to actually use. I used to have one. Where'd it go? Ah, oh, shit! There it is! Haha! <laughs> Only problem is, it's a shitty ass little keyboard. Let's see, does it have any charge on it? It does indeed, too. <laughs> nice. Alright, that might work. So, it's two for the little tree, poster, the food, place settings, and the orchestration. So, hanging around would be worth it. Okay, so we'll actually do it, get enough to get the total for each one of them. So, it's like two for the tree, two for the poster, two for the food, place settings, and two for the uh, orchestra. So, you need at least eight. So, we actually uh, need two more to actually do a run. Is there also like old fat, the Starlight Cookies and the older stuff actually available for sale as well? Because I think I saw that at one point that you can buy some of the older items. You buy a couple of stacks of cookies to have throughout the year. Which I never get around to using because, eh. <laughs> okay. So, we'll definitely hang around for another one. Ten? Two, four, six. What was it? Two, four, six. Oh, there are two like two different place settings or so on. Yeah, fair enough. Works for me. I have no problem with doing so. And I uh, get to hang out with cool people while I'm doing it. That's the best part. Oh yeah, I need to get the keyboard hooked up here. Let's see. Hmm. I may. Oh, wait, what is this one? It's one for each one, which is a pain when I'm choosing for them for the cafe. Oh. Yeah. I imagine actually would be. Um, I'm going to jump out here and quickly see if I can pick up this keyboard. It may connect. If it does not, it does not. Well, it could be just the batteries that look. Turn on keyboard. Bluetooth devices. Jesus. Oh, that's right, because other people's Bluetooth actually have added to it. Uh, I need to pair it. How would I pair it if it hasn't already. Hmm. 
should that should make it discoverable. But it's not recognizing it. That's annoying. I don't even know where the USB thing is for it anymore. There used to be a USB a dongle that you could use instead of the Bluetooth. <sighs> Bluetooth keyboards. Why are you so pin? Right, let's see here. Um, no, nah, that ain't gonna work. <laughs> Abandon ship. Because otherwise it's gonna require a lot of cable shell from to be able to get it to fit in. Whoa. Uh Damn, it got very dark. I mean. Oh, right. I was wondering what's going on there. There was actually a little bit of a glitch in, but it's also the fact there's lightning storms going on. I thought it was actually just a glitch. Oh, God damn it. Hit them. Stop trying to hit them and hit them. There we go. that I just go straight from like Christmas tune to actually like surf punk <laughs> or like a uh, surfer tunes. Ah, shut up. Leave me alone. Harbor Boulder is going to eat my ass. We're almost finished this. Why do they, they, they seem to be running further and further away? They died. Ah! Drunk by a spell. Tommy Tree Stolops. I'm going to kill everything if I actually. Are they slowing? Oh, are you serious? I can all wait. Oh, that was close. I'm pretty sure he's actually getting knocked down by that. So, yeah, we have another picture. What have we got now? D, 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 D. We have six. Four more to go. And he's a well on horseback. Damn. I now have a bluebird minion. I can't use it at this moment in time. Alright, cool. We've got a little bit of pizza I actually picked up from um, probably my subscription. So, two more times, two more times. Then we're going to check out the place where we can buy the thing. It does seem like less festive whenever it is so dark and stormy out here. I mean, yeah. Is it meant to be this dark? Or is that just. Ah, uh, it's a lightning. Oh well. 
Thunderbolts and lightning, very, very frightening me. Time spent waiting, waiting, waiting. <laughs> yeah, and then you see the time. Makes sense. I'm just playing catch up with the messages for you guys. Oi! It's bear jump. You have to actually throw a explosive. Get the diamond. Miss the jump. Ah, didn't catch me. Gotcha. Explosive anywhere. George <laughs> playing chicken with bears. Bear chicken. Game of Chicken Bear. <laughs> A fist full of Christmas. Yeah, that's actually the next Die Hard movie. It's gonna be Die Hard Six. Is it actually up to now? Die Hard Six: A Fist Full of Christmas. My hello there. Welcome to the party, pal. Just waving to the new person. <laughs> Like Big Brother, just swear away. Are live from the Big Brother house. Please do not swear. I also help if I did that into the right chat. Is no longer funny whenever I have to type it. It's been this long typing it. Live from the scary forest, it is the party of five. Riding bears into battle.
And I think the bigger swear word is actually Paul Simon. Why'd you just go fudge yourself? It's a shooting gallery. Ah, that one. That's good. That was perfect. Need to focus. I'm gonna focus on one fucking tree at this time. I'm gonna follow him, and I'm gonna make sure that he's dead. Then go on to the next one. Back here, you fuck. Oh, it wasn't even the killing blow. Boom. So quick. Done and dusted. Happy days. All good. So we are up to eight now. Only got one more to go. Yeah, you really don't. But I mean, there's nothing wrong with that. I mean, festive events never actually were a high difficulty thing. Ah, that's relaxing. Wait, who's missing? Gonna, Harry, Emily, who's, oh, there you are, yeah. Rivaling S rank levels, what does that mean? Oh, thank you very much for the friend request. I will respond to it very shortly. Jen, did I have any other festive hats? No. Nothing else festive. Ooh. Um. Yes, all the festive stuff already. Yep, yeah. uh, I will respond to that just in a moment. Requests. Uh. Erp derp. Eh, let's grab from here then. I thought it was actually listed in the same uh, section. Social. Yes, I will accept the request. Oh, the S rank hunts? They were fun. Yeah, man. Um, you remember like what the, the mild punishment you would get from actually being the person who would actually like pull you know when they make the call for like the pull for it's like pull in 30 seconds and there's like one guy sitting there going like oh like casting half of a spell and then cancel it and then casting half of a spell and then cancel it and then casting half of a spell and then cancel it. And like, yeah, you're you're literally just playing with fire, man. Everybody enjoyed being that asshole. Just like this bear's asshole. Right there. Right. There.
Hmm. I actually do like this room better than the other one, but... I don't know. Imagine more, like, all of the actual helpers are wearing these robes this time. I want to wear one that's actually from earlier. Alright, I'm just gonna try on some other clothes while I'm sitting here wandering and waiting. Or wandering and waiting, I suppose. Um I think I got the squall outfit or was it the actual like the cloud outfit? Legacy Warrior. Nice! Let's try. <laughs> oh, that looks nice. Hmm. Tadless vest. Right, remember that. Yeah, I prefer my festive stuff anyway. That's true. More than one spawn zone would have made sense, especially in the area, because that would have had people running from one to the other, so that way they could actually literally have people farming it. But I think part of the reason why is they just didn't want to have people actually chasing after uh, the boxes that quickly. I mean, it does, it does lower the value of what the objects are. I mean, whenever there was ones where you could only do like three maximum per day or five maximum per day, that, that kind of made sense, made people come back over and over again. And festive is damn awesome. I'm so happy to have a festive bear. I'm gonna ride my festive bear everywhere I like. I want to ride my festive bear. I want to ride my bear. I want to ride my festive bear. I'll ride him anywhere I like. <laughs> Not fish and chips. What is that? Ba 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 bum. <sighs> so many Christmas tunes stuck in my head from like working retail recently that I was just like, I, I don't. What joy I would get at this time of year just like singing festive tunes to myself. I don't have them. It's, still bad. it's hard. It's hard to actually bring up the joy and excite yourself for it whenever. <laughs> Meme. -ness. All right, uh, <laughs> Moonfire Fair, that was all right. I wish I'd actually be taking part in more festivals this year. This is because I just don't have time to come back to him. I'm always like, I feel stupid because I'm going like, where is everything in the menu again? <laughs> Christmas songs in retail are, they are the bane of anyone's existence. Um, I think the ones that we've actually been listening to most, we, have, we purposely find an alternative Christmas playlist, and some of them are absolutely batshit insane. Uh, it's not like, uh, like an entire Christmas album by Polyphonic Spree. That was a little bit different. <laughs> that or Jazz Christmas. Well, thankfully enough, I've got a kind of where I the job I'm in is a little bit more flexible where we can put on whatever the hell we like. And it's just the fact that you can't put on something that's Christmas, but you kind of just barely have to be Christmas at all. And you just try to avoid the regular ones that you're going to hear absolutely everywhere else. Ooh, there we go. Let's kill some trees! Don't hug a tree, kill a tree!
Nice, nailed him. God damn it! Die, you fucking tree! Do any of these fucking trees get in the way? This is one of the things where you just try to predict the patterns for them, but it's. Feels so unbelievably erratic. Ah, uh, too far. Up. Hey! Bad luck comes in trees. Is that us? Um, fully completed. Do we have enough? Do I have enough? Yes, ten. Right, so that's going to buy all of the things, and we'll see what we've actually got. <laughs> Are they scamper? Yes. I mean, that's still the fact that it's like weird to see a tree scamper. <laughs> Christmas songs getting remixed into YouTuber songs. <laughs> Good fun. Yep, time to head back. So, back to Old Gridania, is it? To the uh, the staging area. That sound good? Yay! 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 We did it! The bears did it. <laughs> Indubitably, we were actually doing a very good job of destroying those trees. Aw, aw! Thank you very much. So it's just like every once in a while just getting offered a taxi by your friends going like, man, man, you're too good. You're too good to me. <laughs> barely accomplished? I barely broke a sweat. Ah, wrong way. This event is just the bare necessities. It's not really a big elaborate show, is it? Wait, where the fuck did I go? I went the wrong way again, didn't I? Wait, no. Yes, I did. God damn it! <laughs> I need to stop just doing this. <laughs> that was a very, very, like, tw twisted one. Ursa Inuit? Ursa Inuit? <laughs> Nicely done. Nicely done. Really tells me you're instrumental in actually the rescuing of the de decorations. When I look at you, I cannot help but recall the Ishgardian Knights from the tale of the first Starlight Celebration. Such selflessness and generosity. You truly are an example to us all. <laughs> you just end up actually making somebody feel better. What's wrong with Elvius? Aw, sitting there all alone. So where is the people's? Oh, this is where we drop them in. Yeah, cool enough. Spinner's blessings. I'm here to spread the word for the Starlight Celebration. Should you have any questions, please feel free to ask away. I know. I need to know nothing of this. I know plenty. Let me take a part in this since you were just a child. Right. So, starlight boxes. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right. So yeah. This is the interesting stuff. So I'm not gonna worry about the meals 
food for now, but I will probably end up grabbing a few magic prisms. But I'm going to get the orchestration rule first because I want that bad. I want it so bad. Yes, two of those trade. Uh, da -da -da. See, I don't have a place to live, so I may not grab those just yet, but I'm going to definitely grab one of these. Wait, what? Do I already have? Second, it says a quantity. Do I have any? I'm going to. Do I already have those? Hmm. Do do. Look in here. Yeah, so I'm going to grab that. Uh, ah, inventory. Not armor chest. And use you. Use. Hooray! Registration list. Let's go. Cool. I might as well get my Wii Alpha Nod and everything else out as well. Look Literally, my pockets are just filled with shit left over from last Christmas. That's literally all I've got there, other than... Huh. It really is. What? None of air! Oh, I already have that one. That was actually from you guys last time. Sweet! That's what that was actually left over from. I was curious for a moment there. Um... Oh, I didn't own that one. Alright, just checking my stuffs. <laughs> like they're carrying those things randomly around with the leftover from ages ago. But yeah, six left, and I have not bought anything else. Yeah, um, I'm pretty sure, like, I could get a housing, that'd be no problem at all. It's just the fact I don't play often enough, so I'd be afraid of losing all the stuff that I had in it, if I did, just because I'm not here regularly enough. I would love to come back again on a regular basis if I had, like, get you guys to play with. That's actually kind of cool. I would actually like to come back to play, I would like to play, come back and play regularly enough that I could go through at least all the main, like, scenario content with friends, rather than actually doing it all solo. So what else is in here that's actually worth grabbing? Yeah, nothing for spell speed. That's a little annoying. Uh, so I might as well grab the rest of the decorations, I suppose. Just because I have two, four, six left. So exchange for you. Exchange for you. Exchange for you. And exchange for you. And that's all of the things I have. Is there actually um, a store selling other stuff, or is that just the only? Is that the only things that are actually done, being done for Star Celebration this year? Oh, houses, yeah. I suppose. Oh, there. That's right. There is a difference. There's apartments and houses now. Hmm. But it's like 45 days if nobody goes into them. I completely forgot. Like, essentially, you have your um, wee personal space. I like, because I wouldn't ever, whenever it's playing this, I wouldn't ever be inside the inns for somewhere to stay. Yeah, it's like absolutely everything. I'm a little bit, I'm a little bit upset now that that's actually like that's absolutely everything for Starlight Celebration this year. A little bit. Mm. That's kind of like that's that's a little bit sad, you know. Um. As much it was so much fun last year. It was actually like a couple of a couple of fun events. Something that you'd actually run through back and forth. Um, is there anywhere that's actually really really fun for popping into, for um, you know, like festive events? Is there actually any, is there anywhere that actually looks festive? Maybe nice to actually just sit and hang out in for a while because it was it was such a better experience last year just because I ran into you guys. I suppose more than anything else. Oh, are you serious? I was a day early. I used to doing it tomorrow. Well, you know what? I'm gonna probably be here again tomorrow. I'll come back. I'll, I'll be back in again for like for tea and cookies. Not wrong with tea and cookies. Tea and cookies are always good, baby.
So yeah, I suppose um, I might actually stop this week's segment because I'm actually we're still recording live. But yeah, ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for actually watching this. It's been a bit of fun actually sitting down into Final Fantasy XIV for the Starlight Celebration. We grabbed some bears, we rode them around. In fact, I'm going to actually get on my bear. Where's my bear? Where's my bear, baby? I love you, bear. Oh, no, I can't wear bear hair. No. In that case, I'm just going to stand very close to this one. <laughs> look, he doesn't look like a happy chappy. So yeah, um, the Starlight Celebrations on uh, Final Fantasy XIV are still ongoing up and through after Christmas. I uh, hope you actually enjoyed yourselves. I want to say thank you very much to everybody who actually was here and stayed with me while we're actually watching this live and also all the people who have appeared in the chat here. Uh, say hi to all yourselves. Uh, <laughs> pretty much, I just gave the full list of actually everybody who's actually hanging out for the show. Morgana, Ameline, uh, Irie, Irie, <laughs> Irie, and um, everybody else who was actually in the same fate area while we were actually fighting. That was actually really fun to do. Uh, it's good to actually have good company while doing it. A little bit sad that the uh, festivities are a little bit shorter and smaller this time. We may just come back live on stream. Uh, like you said, uh, we're having a, a tea and cakes and tea and cookies at, on the server tomorrow. So I will probably jump back in again to hang out with these wonderful people once again. But again, thank you very much for watching. And we'll see all you dudes in the next video. Bye.